Welcome back to the channel. So today we are going to put some 1.9 class one tires on the elements. Uh, last video on the element when we did the initial overview and test drive, uh, you know, felt like the tires was definitely a weak link on it. And I think I mentioned that I had some other tires for it. So I've had these Hyrax class ones. Uh, I just need to get some wheels. And what I actually found out was I had some Gen 8 wheels laying around. They would not clear the hubs or the steering linkage on the element. So I had to find some different wheels that would clear. These are the same 1.9 Proline wheels that I have on the Predator with the um, landmines. And I had tested and verified that they cleared. So I picked up another set to put these Hyrax on. So we're going to take it out and see how it does with some good tires on it. So I hope you stick around. So here's the stock element tire, the new uh, tire. As you can see, there's a little bit of a height difference. So we should gain maybe a tad bit of clearance with these tires. So we'll be getting these mounted on here. And that's basically how it will look. So let's get them on and get it outside. All right, first run on the Hyrax Class 1 tires. I think she's gonna make it up this. So we're gonna skip this for now.
So we're gonna try to see if we can get up the back side of this. Coated in dirt. Alright. <clears throat> so she don't want to get up there for now. So that'll be it for this test run. So there you have it, what do you think? So I wanna be tell you, you know, I wasn't able to get up the first obstacle. Um, after filming, I kept playing around with the truck and decided to try some more getting up that. And I actually got up it twice um, from, the, from the beginning side going up. I uh, got it from each side. Took, took me like a minute, you know, each, each time to sort of, and sort of just go with it and, you know, sit there and just let the tires turn, 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 turn until finally got it. Uh, tried to get up the back side, coming back across, wasn't able to do it. Uh, I've had a lot of rain lately. The That dirt area there is still sort of wet, so the dirt's sticking to the tires really well, and I think that's playing some factor into it. Um, you know, and knowing the right line, because you've got to select a different line, or slightly different line with that truck, because you got straight axles, no portals, don't have quite the same ground clearance as you know some of my other vehicles have so the line is much more important and i think i'm still learning the truck for sure so tires i think did a good job uh i have my next competition coming up uh this next weekend so i plan to run that truck in class one as well as my predator gen 8 in class two uh, and i have a couple mods on the way for the enduro uh one of them's here and i'll be doing that mod before this competition so you'll see a video coming out on, on a small little mod for it um, definitely need more wheel speed so motor upgrade uh, I'm gonna be moving some motors around on some of my rigs uh, to free up the right motor for it and uh, so guys I hope you like what you see today and if you do please like share and subscribe until the next time